the i button is very important in abacus and you can get a lot of information from it i personally assume that it stands for information query information here so what you can do you can get the information from your part for example if you want to know the position of a node you can decide you can see it from here but it is different from assemblies and parts so if you pick that node from here it show you different value so it is that for part it is a local so the zero value probably stands here the the center of our coordinate but for assembly the center of coordinates is here so that's why the, the position is different you can find the distance between two nodes you can pick from different points every two nodes from the center to the edge angle feature shell elements but one of the most important uh, parameter that you can see is going to the mesh and selecting on mesh you press click bottom and down bottom and you see the number of elements that we use in this geometry if you select element you can see the number of nodes that has been attached to it and that element name if you define your mass you could have your mass properties like you can see the volume center and also because we didn't have density we cannot find the mass these queries are different from odb in odb if you go you might see fewer options like mass property you can see it in here because we already defined it the moment uh, of inertia and also you have more options like probe value i need to stop the animation here i go to a uh, prop value you can have element node options i click node and then you can select it and then you can see the for example one misses a stress from this point or this point or this point it can be in all direction and you can see the different component of stress it can be elements for elements you can see different of them but for elements you might need to consider is it integration points centroid points or element nodal for example for element nodal fun fact uh, my abacus just crashed by clicking on element nodal mine is not functional on it uh, hope, hope, hope yours can work on it but yes so these are the functions that you can use from query you can get a lot of information from it and can help you to have a better modeling skill in the next video i will show you how you can edit the part or assembly and also how you can use undo button in some cases